At the beginning of Season 13, the Spitfire came out of the care package with a slight nerf and the Flatline came out of the Replicator. So now we have two more readily available options that are both pretty strong right off the ground. But let's go through the stats and see if we can figure out which one is objectively better. First off, let's go over the attachments and recoil. With Apex Legends Saviors, they actually removed the barrel stabilizer from the Spitfire, so now both the Flatline and Spitfire use an extended heavy mag, any sight other than snipers and digi threats, and a stock. So because of this, there are no advantages to either weapon there. But because neither one uses a barrel stabilizer, their recoil patterns never change, which can be good and bad. However, one clear difference is their iron sights. While I'm lucky enough to have the Season 4 Battle Pass skins for the Flatline, the Flatline's iron sights don't cover the top half of whatever you're aiming at, whereas the Spitfire iron sights cover the majority of where you're looking, except right in the middle. Now, taking a closer look at their recoil patterns, you can see that the Flatline's recoil is somewhat diagonal up and to the left, with some sharp horizontal turns, whereas the Spitfire's recoil is much more vertical with only a slight horizontal component. And when you add an extended mag on each of them, you can get a little bit more of that horizontal back and forth with those extra bullets. But both of them can be controlled once you learn how much to pull down and move back and forth. But I will say the Spitfire is easier to control due to its verticality in this recoil and it has a slower fire rate, which we will talk about soon. But when comparing the hip fire sprays, the Spitfire actually has less spreading or at least a little more even spread than the Flatline, which is opposite of what I thought initially because I am a firm believer in these Flatline's hip fire. Now moving on to the general stats of each gun, first off we'll look at damage. For the Spitfire, it does 15 to the legs, 18 to the body, and 27 to the head, while the flatline does 14 to the leg, 18 to the body, and 32 to the head as it has a higher headshot multiplier. So each gun does the same amount of damage to the body, but the flatline does have an advantage because it has a 10% faster fire rate than the Spitfire, giving it a higher DPS and a faster time to kill, as well as those higher headshot damage. Next, looking at the reload time and magazine sizes, the Spitfire is 40% slower to reload than the flatline, but it has a larger mag size, so you shouldn't have to reload it as often. But the mag size is where these guns really, really differ. The base mag size for the flatline is 20 bullets, while the Spitfire has 35 bullets to start. That is enough to down almost four enemies off drop if you hit every shot. But when we add in the purple extended mags, the flatline gets 30 bullets as its max, while the Spitfire has a whopping 50 bullets. With that many bullets, you can easily down three enemies with red armor, only hitting body shots, and still miss 11 bullets. This is where the Spitfire really shines and why you'll see lots of people running it in the arena. So when I thought about making this video, I was sure that the flatline was going to be the clear winner because I love its hip fire and fast time to kill. But after doing all this research and using both weapons for the past few days, I'm not so sure anymore. So down in the comments, tell me why you think one is better than the other.